Okay, we are back to more of the red zone, and I'm just gonna jump in immediately, uh, just cause I think this is when it's gonna start taking a while to get through each of the fights. Oh. Oh, it starts off end. That's awesome. As you can see, I know that I, you know, I don't know too much about, like, a lot of these stages, but I do know that real though ends AGL, so I purposely left Super Saiyan 4 SCR Goku off, and I brought the now easy aid, Gogeta. Um, but he started off on the int rotation, that's, that's awesome, dude. That's so good, whoa. Um, granted, I've heard that, so, I don't know why I said granted. This is where, like, it apparently starts getting very, very hard, is with Rieldo, Baby, and I've heard Cooler's pretty hard, but he, he I, I've heard he's not, like, on Rieldo and Baby's levels, but with this whole challenge, GT Heroes is a little bit better than, uh, Movie Heroes, and we actually have the 200% leads out now, so hopefully this isn't gonna be, like, too, too terribly hard. I mean, I do hope it's a challenge, but I hope it's, like, a challenge that, like, I can beat. You know, you know what I mean. Also, I can't believe he's doing like how much damage is he doing to like in Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, like 70 something K? Oh, he's about to hit. Oh, dodge! I didn't even know I had any dodge on him. I want to be completely honest. Um, okay, yeah, that that that's good. That's good right there. I'm pretty sure he's just dead here. Ooh, yeah, this isn't this isn't too bad. I say as it's phase one of, I think, three? Is it three? Is he gonna go into hyper real though and then metal real though? Or is he just gonna go into metal or hyper real though and that's it? I don't, I don't know. I'm pretty sure, whenever I see like screenshots of this, it's always like hyper real though. But that would be weird to not finish up on his strongest form, you know? That would that be weird. See, with the 300%, I mean, two, two, 300%, okay. But the 200% leads out, it's easy. Oh. Um. Goku is at 200k defense. I don't. Something tells me that ain't good enough if he supers us. I know that the stats for these guys are out and everything, and I could look at. Actually, I'm gonna pull them. Oh, 64k. 50, okay, 57k, that's not terrible. And he is about to get a defense raise, but I'm pretty sure a super is gonna kill us. Um, red zone. It's a little hard to type around my microphone. Boss stats. Also, I would like to say I still don't have the 200% lead. The 200% leads myself, even though I have gone. Oh, yo, countering again. Let's go base. I have gone. Several hundred more stones. I think I am at currently up to a thousand stones. Um, on the Super Saiyan 4 banner alone. Where's the open redstone stat? Did I? I lost. It was Goten and Trunks, though. Yeah. Let's look at GT heroes really quick. Hang on. Hang on. Just because their, their problem is, like, if they could, like, triple super right off the bat, they wouldn't be tanking phenomenally, but they would be, like, tanking enough. You know what I mean? Um, honestly, I think... There's not really a better physical option, but, I mean, a, another physical option that we could bring. Um, and don't judge my Ooh being only level 22 with nothing in him. Don't judge that. Let's just bring these guys. The only other option I was thinking about was these guys, because I actually like these guys a, a decent bit. They could definitely be better, like, unapologetically just a little bit better. If they just added even raise the defense for one or three, if they raise defense for three turns, they would be wild in my opinion. But, uh, we didn't exactly get that, so no use complaining. Also, this is Goku family, right? Yeah, let's just go ahead and bring it. Just just because we can. Yeah, I can't find the I can't believe I got so distracted when my guys were all dying. 
And I'm pretty sure this is a permanent buff to Goku family, isn't it? Yada 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 yada. Yeah, and play. I, I am gonna skip it. I don't care all that much about uh about those. Okay, so this isn't too bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just go that one that path. And then if Goten and Trunks can just super twice, we should be fine. Oh, oh, did I find it? This isn't as like. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm just gonna go to like. Truth's video, because does he have it linked? <gasps> Truth didn't link it! But he does. It does show where I can get it. This is the most entertaining commentary of the Red Zone, I know. Luca. Dokkan. Red Zone. Yo, let's go! Let's go! Also, I'm recording this, like, as soon as it came out. It's probably not gonna be up until, like, the day after. But that's. Oh, dude. It's okay. Um, and yeah, let's just blow him away really quick. Okay, so... Okay, so he does end at Metal Real Bell. Um, currently, his normal attacks are hitting for 230,000. Crap, dude. Already it's that hard? Okay. Um, and his SA damage is 575,000. How... Okay, so he's only 30,000 stronger in terms of normal attacks between stages. Which is a lot, which is not as much as it felt like. Oh my gosh, but his super attack damage gets up to 728,000. You have to have that, well, over that much because we're super using almost, oh, entirely, entirely, uh... uh what was I thinking? Uh, da -da -da -da, my brain's not working. We're using entirely... Okay, yeah, so we're gonna take... I'm just gonna go ahead and pop Icarus. We need over 728,000 damage in defense because we are super fast. That is crazy. That he hits that hard. And that's why I'm gonna go straight into baby... Wait, what type is... It? Oh, he's tech at the end? I thought he was AGL. I thought he was AGL at the end. No... Okay, it's fine. Everything's fine. He definitely didn't just. I mean, granted, I don't think we're gonna kill him next rotation, so I can rotate off Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta, so that's good. But I'm really glad I wrote, I got a uh, Goten and Trunks out of here, because even if they had like they could have triple supered and been on main rotation every single time, and they would be dead. There's no way he would survive. Like, his normals, maybe they could tank his normals, but it, one super instant death. Okay, and then up, up next is Bobby, which is who we are doing next. And I'm actually going to let these guys stack a little bit more. We will take a lot of damage if he supers anyone, but I don't think it's going to be enough to, to kill anyone. I'm probably just gonna let these guys stack up up until we get up into Metal Rail though, and then just transform and blow them away. That I think that's a solid, solid strategy, honestly. Oh, he se oh he seals. Wait, he seals? Oh my gosh, he wait. Or was I saying he's immune to that stuff? Oh, I don't know. I was looking away at the time. My bad. I have a bad tendency of doing that in general. Okay. Go in trunks. I mean, go, go to and Gohan. Get the trash. Let's go. I love this unit. One of my favorite units. Oh, they're so good. <laughs> they're so good, dude. Like, just such a salt. Like, they're all. They are pretty much just stats and support. But for what they are, they're so solid. I know they're not as good as, like, third form Frieza and stuff like that, but, like, still. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna go like this. Yo, I, I love this actor skill. 
But he is so, so good, dude. Both the Super Saiyan 4 Gogetas are. I am gonna say, though, I am honestly immediately way more, because I did, like, the uh, legendary Goku runs with GT, uh, GT heroes and GT bosses. I am immediately way more impressed with Omega. I can't even lie. Like, I was on a 150 and a 130 team, and Omega's out here triple th throwing out three 6.8 million attack stats, and it's like, what the freak, dude? If I was running double, because I was thinking about just running, like, double Shadow Dragons uh, Saga leads with two Omegas, I just couldn't find another Omega on the friends list. Only to find out that the friendly doesn't count when I was doing the uh, Super Saiyan 2 run for the Vegeta event. But that, that's fine. That's fine. It's okay. But, like, he was absurd. And Gogeta's, like, solid. Gogeta's really good. I just think my main, I guess, like, quote-unquote issue with him... Oh, and we can't switch him out. And that defense isn't... Isn't looking too sexy, not gonna lie. Um... I'm, I'm really scared of putting... What, what's... We'd be taking about just as much damage if we put Vegeta up front, but I think even if we transformed, unless we countered his super, I think we would just die to his super. So honestly, I think I'm gonna go like this. And then let's just... I think I'm gonna leave them like this a little bit longer. Just because they're not gonna stack up a ton, but I think a few, like, two more stacks, which is what they're gonna get, would then help us finish him off next time and have enough defense to for me to feel comfortable putting them up front. Ugh. But, oh, right, because they lost... Don't they lose some of their stats after five turns? I think that's what happened. Um, but anyways, honestly, with Gogeta, like, if he didn't have a great chance to counter, which I think is what they were scared of, I honestly think he would, like, just not be... I don't think he'd be as good as Ink Gogeta, which is sad, because we're actually going to look it up right now when Ink Gogeta... When did Ink Gogeta release on Globo? Okay, I am watching, though, to see it. Oh, he dodged! Oh, he's getting supered! So, regardless of what happened, I'm glad I used Icarus there. 376,000! Okay, dude! Cool beans, I, I love to see that! When did Ink Super Saiyan Gogeta release on Global? Yeah, I mean, he's, he released a year and a half ago. Oh, oh, that's awful. Um, is there any way Vegeta survives all of that? Like, I know he's going to get, does he even get any defense on his super? I'm pretty sure he, yeah, he greatly raises for one turn. So honestly, if he doesn't get supered, I think we'll be okay. Ooh. I honestly should have tried to plan my rotations better than not. Granted, at the same time, he would have been back at some point on this before we finished him regardless, you know? Even if he had transformed with the Super Saiyan 4s, I didn't think to be finishing this rotation. But yeah, anyways, like people got like really mad when uh Tech Gogeta. Super Saiyan Gogeta wasn't, like, head and shoulders better than, uh, STR Vegito. And I sort of feel slightly similar to this. Like, I didn't need him to be, like, head and shoulders above. But, like, I don't know. I feel like they could have just given him a little bit more to his stats in general, you know? Like, maybe let him start off at, like, 180% instead of 150%. Like, I don't, I don't know, dude. The fact that, like, they're comparable... And I think, oh no, please don't, dude. I haven't gotten like any of the stacks up. But we're transforming here regardless. Um, but like, and I also have two more dupes into that Gogeta, so I was expecting him, because I have my Super Saiyan Tech Gogeta rainbowed, and I have my Int Gogeta with two dupes. So the fact that like I find their like performance is semi-comparable, like, I, maybe, maybe if he was just, like, always super, I think he just buff up his defense a little bit. Like, maybe his defense could start off at one. Oh, 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 did we just win? 
Maybe if we start with like his defense at like 180, but his attacks at 150, but then just make him always super effective. Right there, that's it. Because his attack stat is higher, but on half the time when he doesn't isn't super effective, he's doing less damage than In Gogeta, especially if In Gogeta has. Oh. Okay. Well, I mean, he's dead, so. But I think that's like my biggest issue. Like they're like too comparable for being a, like a year and a half younger. You know. You know what I mean? Like, it's just, uh, could have just been a little better. Again, probably just 180% defense, you know, get his defense a little bit higher. Like, I want to make him like a defensive god. But make it a little bit better. And super effective against types, always. That right there makes him better, but not like a thousand times better. But, uh, yeah. I'm just gonna hop, since this one went 15 minutes, I'm just gonna go ahead and hop into the, uh, baby one in the next video. Bye-bye.